For this tutorial, we are going to take on the role of a student. So I am logged on as Doug Hernandez, who is one of my falsified students for the purposes of these tutorials. When I come into Google Classroom, this is what I feel as a teacher is one of the gaps in Google Classroom. I think there should be a notification over here on the Comtex 7-2 that lets Douglas know he has a late assignment in that class. We've had a deadline come and go. He was supposed to hand in a picture of a plant or an animal and he's not done that. I wish there was something here that notified Douglas that he is missing an assignment. And so as a teacher, where Google Classroom gives me the opportunity to give feedback about it, I am going to give that as feedback the next time I'm logged in as a teacher because I do feel that's a critical piece that should be showing. There should be a red badge or something here notifying you have a late assignment. I would encourage other Google Classroom users who are teachers to also do the same to let Google know that that would be really valuable to have a notification there. So as Douglas, I'm going to come in to Comtex 7-2 and I'm going to point out another challenge that I've found with Google Classroom and it says, woohoo, no work due soon. That's true. There is no work due soon. The About Me is not due until September 30th but Douglas has an overdue assignment and that should be noted somewhere unless Douglas starts to scroll down the screen, he is not aware until he gets to this point that he has a late assignment. I think these would probably be fairly easy things for Google to include, but Google is a company who deals in software. They are not teachers. They need the feedback from teachers to be able to make these changes. I've seen a number of changes roll out in Google Classroom over the last year that would be based on feedback they've received from teachers. And I think it's important that we give Google that feedback that on the previous screen there should be a notification or at least here in the classroom, this is very misleading to say, woohoo, no work do soon. As a teacher, I am aware that Douglas is missing an assignment. And so I'm gonna be bugging him because that's my job. But it would be helpful if in his digital life, he had a few reminders. Google Classroom does integrate into their calendars and we will take a look at that in another tutorial. But I wanna point out to you that it does give a bit of an incorrect impression there. I, I'm hoping that's temporary. So let's scroll down. Douglas is aware. I've been bugging him for the last week. Where's your picture? Where's your picture? Where's your picture? So Douglas has, he's had enough of me. He's gonna hand in the picture. So he's probably wondering right now, can I hand in a late assignment? What do I do? Easy. Same as if he were handing it in on time. He's going to click this open button and he's going to add the file. Just like everybody else did when they handed it in on time, Douglas is just a little bit late with it. So he's going to attach a file. We're going to select file from the computer. We're going to go to the desktop. There's the picture of the dog. We are going to upload that. Just take a second for that to take place. It's gonna show us a preview thumbnail of what it is he's handing in so he knows for sure he's handing in the picture of the dog. He didn't accidentally click something else. And when we click turn in, it's gonna give a verbal um, confirmation of what it is he's submitting and he's gonna click turn in. So now when Douglas goes back to his other screen, it shows done late. It shows that it's done, he's got a green check mark on. But at this point in time, Douglas has to scroll down the screen and take a look at each individual assignment to know where he stands in terms of completion. So I encourage all teachers to submit some feedback to Google regarding those couple things. But for students handing in a late assignment in Google Classroom, it's just truly not a big deal. Just do it the way you would do any other assignment. Just click open and attach it and submit it.